Hi, it's Stuart Fence. I'm the couples expert. Here's another edition of Three Minutes with Stuart. Today I want to talk about being friends. You hear that a lot, that in a relationship you should be best friends. But what does that really mean? What that means is simply, it's about being there for one another and really spending time together. I think sometimes people rush relationships impulsively and feel like they can just jump right into a relationship and feel like they're going to be really close connected for the rest of their lives. It doesn't work that way. Being friends really is about building slowly a relationship where you know that you and your partner are going to have lots and lots of experiences together and know that you can be there for one another. But what that takes is being a good listener and not only giving advice but listening to your partner. When you and your best friend are sitting down and talking there isn't a whole lot of inter-exchange necessarily, but it's really being present. There's a great video by Brene Brown called Empathy, and it's a, it really compares the difference between being empath what empathy really is about. And I urge you to watch it. One of the things about that talk that she did and the, and the cartoon that she created, it gives a good demonstration that being in a relationship where you and your friend and your partner feels empathetic is about just being present. Being there in someone else's pain and vulnerability and not feeling like you have to have the right answer, but you're just going to be there with them. So over time, having multiple experiences like this, we begin to recognize that there's one person in the world that cares about us more than anyone, and that's our partner. We come to know that nothing that we say or do can turn our partner, our friend, our confidant away from us. And when you have that kind of relationship with your partner, you know that your relationship will last a lifetime and you'll be there for one another in the good and the bad times. So I urge you to think about this today and remember, stay connected. Bye-bye.